<laughs> good day, good day. How the honk are you? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dano. And have I got something for you? Yes, we're going to do a model review. Now, I know um, this guy has been out for a little while and uh, stuff like that, but uh, we haven't done a uh, total uh, walkthrough model review of this Hot Wheels. Uh, what is it called? Let's check it on the base here. Get it right. The Land Rover Defender 90. That's right. Uh, this came out... Um, these are, uh, what is the date on this? This came, <laughs> 2020, I believe, is uh, when they came out. Oh, why? what happened? I thought that we had the, yeah, 20, 2021, 20, well, that one's, yeah, that's 2021. Uh, this was the first one. That one came out in uh, 2018. All right, so let's start here. Uh, what I've got here, I've got a little short card. got that one from eBay. Very nice. This is the red, uh, the red Defender 90. Very, very cool. Very cool. I like that. Factory fresh. Uh, short card. Then I got a regular card here. Uh, nice red. We're going to take a look at it out of the package. Oh, yeah. New for 2020. 2020. There you go. Yes, sirree. Factory fresh. Um, so there you go. I've got the uh, short card and long card. I uh, kind of like to collect, uh, collect a little bit on uh, on that. Have you seen that one before? Yeah. <laughs> Here's something that I found and had to pick up. Oh, sorry for the glare. Holy cow. Um, this was a uh, rear wheel. Yeah, draw your attention to the rear wheel. I got it in a Protecto here. Got a little paint smudge on the rear wheel. I don't know. Kind of an error. But, uh, yeah, uh, I think... I bought that in a group, and uh, it was, um, I don't think I bought that off eBay. No, I don't think so. So anyway, here we go. Um, this is the, uh, this is it. So on the other side, we have uh, number 13. Now, as far as I know, Dima, Dima is the guy that, um, at Hot Wheels that designed this little uh, truck. Took it from the real thing and uh, put it into scale. And then on the bottom there, and I am so sorry. Uh, let's focus in here. Uh, I am not sure how to say that. Um, Squandra course. That's a race course somewhere. And I, you know, I'm sorry. I don't rightly know. Uh, if you know, write in the comments down below. Uh, D, obviously, for the Dima there. Um, very cool on the back. It's got the hazard uh, uh, red and white stripes on there, or white stripes on the red truck. And then, so this side here, uh, again, uh, I think the A is for his first name. Uh, 07, I'm not really sure what that is. Uh, not really sure. Not really sure what the 07 is. Not really sure what the 13 is. Maybe that was the the month that it came out in the day. I'm I'm not sure. You know what I really um, does not have uh, any um, decos or anything on the uh, headlights. Very nice uh, with a winch and uh, slide underneath. It's got the pop up sun roof. Mirrors, very nice. This is very nicely uh, detailed truck. Um, matter of fact, I gotta show you one here. Uh, full size rear tire on it, very nice. It has the uh, uh, what is that? Several select rear off road bumper. There, it's got mud flaps on it. Awesome. Uh, this is a little bit different from the Matchbox in that it has two posts. The one post is uh, right in uh, this uh, bumped Puma hood, I think is what they call it. And then the other one is right in dab in the middle of the truck. Um, and it kind of hides by it. So if you look at the side here, the uh, B pillar uh, kind of hides that, which is really kind of cool, you know. Uh, 
straight on view, you know, you're going to be obstructed and then, you know, peeking through the back windshields, a little obstructed. Wipers on the windshield, very, very nice touch. Very nice touch. I like that. Uh, but just, yeah, just a lot of nice details uh, that, you know, aren't there, but are, are, are there. Uh, they're not painted. Eyebrows on it. Very, very nice. Uh, you know, the back is not detailed with the uh, tail lights. Uh, double plates. I'm not really sure what that is all about, but uh, pretty cool. Got the rear quarter uh, windows in the back. But uh, very, very nice. Traditional uh, fins on top. Look at how bad the paint job is on these things. I mean, man, if I custom painted a truck and sent it to somebody, of course, I wouldn't be cha charging them a dollar. But, man, the paint on these things are ferocious. <laughs> but they are a dollar. So that was the first one, and we were so excited that came out, you know. And so then this is the second one that came out. So uh, 2020, and then it took uh, a whole uh, year, and this came out uh, this year, earlier this year. And so excited. Once again, I have the uh, short card, which is really kind of cool. I uh, kind of like to have a short and a long card. It's something different that they're doing. Uh, Mattel there, Hot Wheels, they're putting that, I don't know, plastic tape to kind of strengthen the uh, the card. And here's the other one, um, the long card. And uh, just not the same without the flame. And so this is a Land Rover 90. This is the Baja Blazers. The first one was uh, Factory Fresh. This one, Factory Fresh. So uh, very, very nice. So uh, let's take a look. Um, you notice that one back there, huh? You notice that? Oh, oh, yeah, that's another little little surprise back there. All right, so this one is a little bit different. Same guy, a little bit better paint. Uh, seems like they really coated this one, but this one is really, it's plain, but it's it's not. Uh, right off the bat, you can see it's got the mud wheels on it. I, I kind of like that. This kind of fits, the mud wheels. I, I was watching some guy on YouTube, and he just like, Get rid of the mud wheels. I mean, um, Hot Wheels especially has done some goofy things with Land Rovers and their wheels. Uh, this I can tolerate. <laughs> I mean, it goes with it. Mud wheels, uh, it's got the mud splatter on the body. Totally goes with it. Now, they got rid of the uh, black eyebrows, which, you know, okay. So, instead, they just went with But it added, added the, um, uh, what is that, the uh, fan... The fan um, vent, uh, added doorknob, added, oh, well, I guess it has a black, the uh, black uh, flame, Hot Wheels flame instead of the white one. But it has the um, uh, trails uh, 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 door sticker or door number thing. <laughs> a placard, I guess, uh, like the trails, uh, you know. Uh, very nice, clean, sharp back end. You kind of see more of the details, all the riveting up and down the sides. That is just totally Land Rover. Um, uh, over here is that door handles, uh, the event again with that Land Rover uh, badging, and then the and then the hood. You know that is just totally awesome. 90 on there because it's Defender 90, and with the Land Rover logo on there, just really nice, just really nice. Um, like I say, I, I do not, uh, this, is, this is all right with me, these mud wheels. If you don't like them, uh, let me know down below in the comments if you don't like them, all right? But uh, I think it fits. It's much appropriate. So this is the last one. This is the, the latest one that's come out, um, I believe, yes, I in the uh, unboxing video. I might tag that one at the end. I don't know. Um this is uh, the latest, greatest one. It is a matte finish, and it is nice. It is nice. Um, boy, I tell you, the, it just is cool. Uh, got the mud wheels again, the mud splatter. Same decos on the side and stuff like that, you know, as far as the door uh, number and stuff like that. But just that matte. They just, I don't know. The, the only way they could have done anything better color on this is if they would have went with the traditional um, 
bronze green and maybe they'll do one that would be nice maybe they'll do one that that would be super um yeah it totally totally cool uh hold on one second uh let me get uh get something for you here all right here look at this um so yeah that just came out I, i've only had the one i only got it on the long card by the way i opened it up on the spot uh i'm waiting they're gonna be out shortly okay all right there's gonna be more check this out i just did this the other day um paint stripped polished it up but you can see on these things how pitted that the the zamax metal is it just is crazy um you know how <laughs> hot wheels mattel relies on their paint to hate to hide such flaws look at the hood look at that that is crazy if we keep in focus here and um try to uh see if we can zoom in but you can see all the pits and everything on there it just is unbelievable so if if you went to go and paint this with an airbrush all those imperfections will show up it's just i mean there's great details look at the door lines you know and the and the section lines you know i mean it is just awesome look at the back here look at that the door handle you can't hardly see it uh in with the rear spare tire on it but it's there look at that check that out and like i say you can see the rivets down the side just totally totally awesome but um yeah just just kind of really kind of cool just to kind of see it uh in the bare metal yes the bare metal um so yeah i got projects and plans for that but uh yeah just kind of cool so there you go ladies and gentlemen just kind of a look at um the um, Hot Wheels Land Rover Defender 90. Make sure you give me a thumbs up. Whoa, give me a thumbs up. Go over to Facebook to Rover Land and uh, let me know what you like. Uh, red, green, or blue. Which one of these do you like? Maybe that red one or that green one or maybe this uh, silver one, huh? Yeah. All right. Have you found any blue ones? Yeah. So there we go. Um, that's it. This is your friend Dano. Thank you for joining me for a Hot Wheels Land Rover 90 model review. If you like what you see, make sure you subscribe and share. Alrighty, that's it. I'm out of here. Thank you very much. Remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover day.